Happy day, friends. It's an exciting day. We are, I believe, officially. Oh, that's a mirror page. Please don't play with that. She's being okay. We are officially finishing our guest bathroom today. This will be the first completed room in our house. Totally completed, huh, Paige? I'm putting it on. Okay, you can put it on there. Just be very what? gentle. What, sweetie? I can't see it. I know, sweetie. So it was very rainy out earlier. It's supposed to be rainy out today. It's looking pretty sunny now, and our projector is looking a little dim. Earlier it was dark enough that they could see it a little bit better, and I was just over here taking measurements to get some blinds down here. We're gonna do some blackout curtains in this room. So when it does come to days where we wanna have a little movie party, I can totally black it out. The curtains work great. I'm gonna show you guys in a second. I'm gonna get blackout curtains for the guest bedroom as well because you can see when it is sunny, that sun shines through. We get great light at this house. This one over here, we're actually gonna soundproof, so we are not gonna get curtains or blinds or shutters or anything on that one. And this one, I'm just gonna go with the blackout curtains as well. And I think that will be the rest of the shades that we need in the house. I keep saying curtains. I don't actually mean curtains. I mean shades and blinds, but downstairs we're doing all roller shades. Let me show you guys what we have up here. So this little magic remote and these magic roller shades. I click a button and they are all programmed to go on their own. This is one of our favorite things to show people when we're kind of showing them our new house because this is such a cool feature. We got all the blinds and shades from selectblinds.com. I was a little bit nervous getting them online because we had to do the measuring, we had to do the install, everything like that, but it was so easy, so easy. I got so many sample colors because I didn't know what I was gonna like, but the samples come free. You can get as many as you want. It's awesome. So happy with it down here. And let me show you guys what I got in some of our other rooms. In our office and our front room, so the two main windows in the front of our house, I wanted a little bit more traditional. I like the blinds. Since we have little kids, we went with the cordless and literally, how easy is that? I could not be more thrilled. <laughs> literally, these are the coolest things ever. This one is even bigger. We were a little bit worried about this window because the blinds at our old house, if you pull them up at all, they drooped big time. But this, literally so easy and it does not droop at all it's absolutely amazing the girls aren't constantly pulling on things and they don't get all messed up because they can literally push it up as well so the ones i showed you downstairs are sheer but i wanted to show you the blackout curtains and we have a remote up here as well <laughs> it makes it so fun and it works so well the blackout curtains so awesome I knew in all the bedrooms I wanted blackout, um, and this is like a zebra print. It's real, uh, real neutral, modern looking. They have so many good colors. Absolutely highly recommend Select Blinds. They have been awesome to work with. So grateful that they sponsored us. And before I forget, I want to mention that every single one of our blinds did not require any screws or holes or drilling to install. They have a system that you can add onto your blinds that you literally just snap them in. I could do it by myself. Austin and I did the whole house in record time. And so I am very eager to get it done downstairs. It just makes the house feel so much more complete when you have something on your windows to dress them up, make them look finished. <sighs> it feels good. I love the sunlight. I really do. I love sun shining through the windows, but something about the curtains down with it, just the nice, sheen of sunlight coming through. I don't even know if that's the right wording to use. Just, mm, it feels good. It feels like fall. It feels calm is what it, it feels like. It feels calm and private and cozy, but still you can tell that there's sun shining through. I will put all the details down below about our roller shades, our blinds, colors, everything like that, as well as a link to selectblinds.com. Highly recommend them if you are looking uh, for any any type of window treatment for your house. 
They've got Roman shades, blinds, curtains. I don't even know all the names of them. They have so many different options, but they have been absolutely wonderful. Okay, you, you gonna help that. us? You gonna help us clean? What do you think? Oh, you hung it already? Yeah. I was gonna give, you were gonna, you are supposed to wait for me. But no, it looks great. You gotta hurry. I was telling them about our Can't be cool, waiting around all day. I was telling them about our cool blinds. Oh yeah, our blinds are dope. That looks good. So this mirror is from our old house. Um, so we got to from our kitchen. repurpose that. Looks great in here. So is it too high? Should I center it between the light and the... the... No, I think it's great. Okay. I mean, for me, looking at it, it looks great. Okay. What do you guys think? It's a little snug up top, but yeah, I but did I think that if intentionally you go any lower. I feel like there's taller people than me, and I don't want them to like not yeah. be able to see in the mirror. It's great. You gonna go potty? Okay. All right. Well, put that seat down, Daddy. I'll help you. Okay, I'm gonna help you. <laughs> you gonna go potty? We haven't officially started potty training. We're kind of getting it in her mind, and every so often she will ask, which is, I think, a really good sign, and we probably need to really roll with it. Here's the loot. I just got the crap scared out of me too, because as I was like pulling all this stuff out, now I'm crapped out. <laughs> I was folding the towels up and bringing them over here and a spider was crawling on one and I screamed a little bit and Micah was like, what's wrong? And I said, Micah, go get me a vacuum. And she did and I vacuumed it up but it still creeped me out. Um, was it a little guy or a big guy? He was like a medium guy but it was one of those red ones. Yeah, gross. Yeah. So obviously lots of neutrals in here. We've got the black faucet, the black hardware stuff in the shower, black mirror. So we're going with a black theme, um, bold and black. But it also looks kind of classy with like, the vanity looks really nice. The marble look on the tile, it's not actually tile, it's fake tile. Uh, but it looks really classy with the herringbone. So I got this shower curtain that was a little bit more fun and colorful to add some color to the room, but I think it's gonna be too much. <laughs> so as a backup, I got this one, which was pretty. Um, simple, just white. I think it'll be fine in there, but we'll see. I'm loving that I can start using some of the stuff that's kind of just been laying around like recently, so this is great. Ready, babe? Are they playing with it? Uh oh. I don't know if I love little monkeys jumping on the bed. Hey, do you guys could remember be worse. the song? Little monkeys jumping on the bed, one fell off and bumped his head. And then what happened? Mama called the doctor and the doctor said... No more monkeys jumping on the bed. You guys can pretend to sleep here though. You can practice. Here, you can do this. Practice the sleepover. No, 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 on your knees, on your knees. You can jump on your knees like this. Yeah, like a... Like a doggy. Or like a... Paige, sit down. Paige. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be a bad one day. There you go, that's much better. That's good. Hey Paige, can you show us how you fly? What's this? All right, let's see it. Hi. Oh, <laughs> that looked like a scared fly. It looked like you hesitated. Let's try it again, Paige, show us again. Go ahead, Micah, show them how it's done. Woo! All right, Paige, super fly. Whoa! Oh good God. job! This is a much better thing to jump on. Yeah, much better. Much safer. Okay, so fast forward roughly 
26, 28 hours. Some of you noticed that we didn't post on Thursday. I had to take a little bit of a personal day. Watch what you say. The bathroom did not get finished like we planned. Or maybe more so like I planned. Austin and I had a little bit of a tiff. <laughs> we were not on the same page as far as what we were doing in the bathroom. I thought we were because I had quite a few conversations as I was piecing together. I don't remember. All, I know you don't remember. I know you don't remember and that's why I wasn't exactly mad at you. But I was very, 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 very frustrated with the situation. <laughs> I had to just go upstairs and cool off because I knew that we were not gonna get anywhere good. Um, so basically, the way that I had designed and planned the bathroom, I had run by Austin. He does not remember. He's had a lot on his plate. So I don't, I don't fault him there. But piecing it all together, figuring out what I wanna do, brainstorming, price matching, searching for the products that were gonna look good together. Like, you know, there's, there's, a, there's a bit that goes into it. And so I had spent a few days doing all this and finding the best prices and finding the right products and figuring out, okay, how is this gonna look? Ran up by Austin, got the clear from him to order everything, checked the prices with him. He said, yep, that looks good. And everything gets here, as you saw. And we start to put the towel bar up and Austin wasn't having it. Did not like the towel bar. He was not having it. And so, you know, my hopes were like, oh, finally, we get to finish a room in this house. And he squashed it real quick. <laughs> you know, after I cooled, I, I wasn't mad that he wanted something different. I was mad that I put all the time and energy and mental energy, especially I'm lagging in that department right now, but the time and mental energy into doing that. And we were just not on the same page, like somewhere along the lines, we just were not on the same page. So after talking about it, after cooling off and on in, in a big part, the kids left, the kids are gone. My parents took them. Coincidentally, it just happened to line up that my parents wanted wanted to take them uh, today for a couple days and it could not have been more perfect timing because we have had so much that we need to get done around here and it's hard when you've got little toddlers running around needing your attention needing snacks every two hours you know it's hard to really get things done so they the girls are gone timing was perfect let me show you what we have done our whole storage room you guys our whole storage room oh my gosh it's all done oh I'll, sh I'll go upstairs and show you the living room soon so that you can see most of it is out of there. But anyways, I digress. So well, we got the, the corner shelving finally showed up. Uh, that did not show up as early as I had planned yesterday. But we talked, we decided, okay, we're not gonna do the towel bar. I wanted some color on this wall from the towels, but we decided instead we are gonna put hooks on here, um, which we kind of planned on anyways but that will be the towel hooks. The guest towels will just be stored underneath here, which is kind of what was planned anyways as well. There will just be more under here, so it'll fill it up, which will be nice, honestly. We are gonna do shelves over the toilet instead of just some decoration, which honestly, I, I think this is all working out for the best. Um, it'll give this wall some extra decoration and a little bit of dimension uh, rather than just having the flat mirror and a flat picture. It'll give it some dimension. I think it'll look good. Um, we decided, I guess we're keeping this wall blank, right babe? Huh? We're keeping this wall blank? Yeah. Is that what we decided? Yeah, I feel like there'd be too much. That's fine. Now. It uh, It's not the biggest bathroom, so I think that'll work. I have not decided on the shower curtain yet. Definitely didn't get around to the final touches yesterday. So, uh, in fact, it, it still needs cleaned and everything. The plumber came out today and finished off all the little things that needed to be done. And so it will be done soon. I'm not, I'm not so bummed about the bathroom not being done because we got to work on the storage area and it's so nice being able to have a room to store all of our junk. Okay, hurry it up. I need your help. 
You got your system worked out? Uh, I mean, I've never done it like this before. I hope so. Okay. <laughs> I think it's gonna look great once we get some stuff on there. Especially once we got that shower curtain on there, some cute little things, some bath items. It's gonna be a cute little guest bathroom. And I love the mirror. Love, love, love the mirror. Hard at work getting this studio put together. Oh yeah! It's looking pretty good. We got all the room in the world. So wait, here. wait, sit back down. Let me show them oh, the, okay. the angle. This isn't finalized. Not right? finalized yet, but we're working on figuring out where the lights need to go, how far over this locker needs to go in yeah, order to look good. A whole slew of things. Um, it's wild because when you, oh, you should have given them the real shot. Huh? Yeah. So there's the there's the studio shot. So all this. <laughs> Just to make this, yeah, we got to put some shelving up behind there and it has lights on it as well. So, we what were you gonna pictures. say? The saying it's weird because when you move, you want your house back to normal as fast as possible, but your old house took years to get to that point, and yet we're trying to cram everything all within like a month, yeah, and so it's just a lot. So, uh -huh. There's a lot of figuring out to do that I had literally years to figure out. Years to figure out this studio. Now we're trying to do it all within days. Yeah. We decided we're going to get like a fiddly fig plant or something to put over here to kind yeah. of transition that space and make it look less empty. Yeah. And then maybe a little plant on this little thing here too. I think that'd be good. And give us all your great ideas down below because we still need to figure out for the wide angle shot this entire area. Like this right here is a blank canvas. Well, I feel like at some point we're gonna have a dartboard. Well, but the dartboard would things. be against that wall. Well, I feel like, the, honestly, I think the dartboard will be a removable prop. Well, yeah, but what I'm getting at is it would be over here anyway. That's true, it would be on this wall. And also, you guys, keep in mind, like when you're giving us suggestions, if you give us suggestions, just something to keep in mind is that this is not a space to hang out in, necessarily. It's not a space for functionality, yeah. I guess. Like this it is, is, but it isn't. this it's is not space. functional. It's a studio. It's meant. Its only purpose is to look good in the camera shot. Yeah. We don't really hang out here. This is not like a room we use. We didn't use it at the old house. It literally is just a workspace. Yeah. We just want it to look good, and that's it. I know that I need to get to bed because I hit a wall like 30 minutes ago, and I have been very unproductive ever since. I'm much more productive in the morning. So I'm gonna get to bed so I can get up early and get more stuff done. Oh, I told you guys I was gonna show you the upstairs. And for the record, Austin and I do fight sometimes. It's obviously never on camera. We do talk about it to you guys sometimes, but we're good now, just to be clear. <laughs> um, yeah, look, all that storage stuff used to be right here and now, it just needs vacuumed because there's some big A spiders that are dead over there. Gosh, look at all that waste. Makes me sick, but we're gonna take it to the recycling <laughs> bin or wherever tomorrow and get rid of it all. All right, guys. It has been, it's been a uh, mentally <laughs> tiring last couple of days. But look, my kitchen's cleaner than it's ever been. Ignore this though. <laughs> Look how nice. I almost feel like I need to put some little planties or decoration or something up. It's feeling pretty barren, <laughs> but I love it. I bet I kind of love it. Thanks again for watching you guys. We will see you next time. Bye friends. Bye. Love you.